Okay, the uh, it's done, and the Dr. Webb Kurilt is still scanning the AS rock. And actually, I saw this right after I shut down the camera a while ago. And so far, it's like it's about three quarters of the way through, and so far it hasn't found anything else. But this is the first one that's found what I originally started scanning for, what I believe anyway called uh, it says it's probably DFH hosts or DFH hosts is corrupted it's uh, a Windows host file uh, and Windows System 32 drivers ETC hosts and uh, I'm sure that that would be the case since the thing was opening up Firefox that's one I haven't seen before it, opening up you know when you open your web browser you might try to go to a website of the infectors choice but this would open up Firefox which was my default browser I'm sure that's why it opened it up and try to go to that website which I read up on and turned out to be I still don't remember the name of it I keep forgetting to check into it before I make a video but it was trying to uh, go to the website that was uh, a click fraud website's what it was it's was trying to you know, uh, turn your machine into a robot clicking on, uh, or a bot as they like to say, clicking on uh, ads to uh, make some money. And uh, the site probably was taken down, I'm sure, by somebody, governments or somebody. Uh, but I, from what I was gathering in my research, it just got moved to a different place, a little bit different name. But, uh, so it's scanning away. See what happens when it's over. So if it can take that out, out of there, uh, the action under actions it says cure and I suppose you can change that I'll wait till the end to figure that out uh, there's a drop down button right there went ahead and made this full screen so that I could read all of it uh, no it doesn't do anything right now maybe when it's over it'll allow you to change it to so of course if you delete your host file then you wouldn't be able to get on the internet so if it can cure it then that would be good um, of course, if you don't get rid of the malware, then it'll just keep getting changed over and over again, a many, many times. I used to have read articles and tell you how to go in and take this bad stuff out of your host file, but it doesn't matter if you don't get rid of the malware. I've tried it. So, I'm gonna, I'll just leave it just like that. Go back to my other machine, get back to work, or whatever it is I'm doing, and come back later. Alright, on out.